Audio files are most interested in how records are made. I found out I found that out by going to all the audio shows. And with my background, I'm often asked, well, what are the differences between a, um, a control room, a studio, and, and my room, uh, my home theater, or my listening room? And at first, you know, it seemed like it would be almost impossible to. Um, translate that, you know, because the, the the differences are quite subtle. But as I thought about it, I realized there were big differences. One of the biggest differences is um, in a control room when you're mixing, you don't want the room involved in the reproduction of the sound the same way as you do when you're listening. Audio files have this thing called a sound stage. They want to be immersed in the, the music. They want it to surround them, not just come from the speakers. They want to add to the performance. Whereas when you're mixing, you, you don't want to hear the room, or you don't want the room to prevent you from hearing what's coming out of the speakers, because then you might not add echo or reverberation to separate two instruments, because um, you couldn't hear it because the room was doing that for you. We listen. We use near field monitors. We listen through small speakers. The, the speakers are balanced on the edge of the, on the top of the console bridge, and we listen at very very moderate levels. Um, nothing loud, nothing you know. And we're listening to direct sound. We want to hear exactly what the instrument sounds like. We want to hear exactly uh, how it interrelate with other, with other instruments and we want to be able to control that whereas um, in a listening room sometimes 50 percent of what you're listening to is not coming out of the speakers it's the effect of the room it's the uh, character of the room adding to adding to the speakers that was a little hard for me to to um, understand I guess to begin with um, having worked 30 odd years in a studio and being so used to direct sound, I picked it up real fast and obviously was able to uh, adapt to that. I quite enjoy it now. Uh, if I had to say which I'd like to design best studios or control rooms, I couldn't. They both are challenges, always. And the biggest, and what I really like is the challenge of working one-on-one -on -one with a, a client. They, some of them have their ideas, put in, they can verbalize their ideas clearly, and others you really have to dig for. And I enjoy doing that, because I all enjoy music. And that's the common denominator between all of us. You know, we, we're doing it, we enjoy music, we're doing it to make the music better.